Peace, 5th of July, 12.35 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Friday. And for those who don't know, my name is Rylan Branch. The name of this label is PimpHop.com and it's on with the show. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this post because I don't really feel like typing. Plus, this is something that needs some authentic conversation so that we can really get to the bottom of this whole situation something that I just saw and you know the rules we just put it up and make it happen and build the plane while we're in flight so what had happened was last night uh, I was scrolling through the Facebook friends list and uh, little mama that's featured Crystal she's actually uh, making the right decision by deciding to go out and work on a holiday where people probably most likely out want to spend some money and receive some entertainment so that service good work on your part crystal um went ahead and gave that a nod of approval and then i came back today and i guess she was stating something that's under her picture on the feature image about uh some kind of backlash that she was experiencing in regards to her chosen profession first of all uh being out here southern california native I think it probably still is somewhat different in other places in the sense that there's some kind of stigma about being um, an exotic dancer, stripper, or whatever name is most appropriate. Um, this is where the land of uh, stars where you name it, chances are she can get it done. So being an exotic dancer it's showbiz. This is showbiz capital of the world, and that's not one of those things. So since she's out in Texas, that might play a part. But even still, in 2013, I think we need to go ahead and provide a resolution for this situation. So we'll go ahead and consider it today, uh, the first day of independence. It is okay for her to be whatever it is she chooses to be and do whatever it is that she chooses to do with her body now one point of interest is that for some reason because I do have to observe the internet um, if she's a stripper or exotic dancer feature entertainer there's some kind of stigma about that I mean when she's actually out in public dealing with people face to face and maybe somebody can actually touch her in the physical uh, there's some kind of shame shame stigma on that but if she is a Instagram model or a Twitter model or even a real model what many of you out there would consider a real model which is actually uh, taking pictures to look like what you think a model looks like uh, photo shoots and all that but nothing for sale that's the key point is nothing for sale um, we need for crystal and other females in her chosen profession to do their jobs effectively uh, in order for us to do our jobs effectively and it's not even so much of a need it's just a well it is a need necessity is the mother of all invention we're going to say that again so she needs to have the proper support and all of you need to have the proper support I keep seeing this phenomenon over and over again but I want to come out with some authentic conversation and say for you young ladies that do have that kind of stigma or that kind of thing that you go through uh, this is a place where you can come and actually get a nod of approval and we can confirm to the world why it is that you're making the correct decision other than that um, you also got the new phenomenon twerking but that's actually invented by dancers or strippers uh, black girls to be specific we gotta keep it all the way one million and that's something that's been done since I don't know six hundred and fifty three AD that's an ancient thing uh, with a new name but like anything else when it becomes popular and socially acceptable gonna get you some kudos with your friends um, people are gonna go ahead and do that which is a step in the right direction but play close attention to how crystal and girls of her like 
she's actually going to get paid because that's a job that she does and this is a business that we run and it's entertainment and everything's out in the open transparent and that's how things function properly and you do what you need to do just like she does what she needs to do to provide uh, for your dependents we got to keep it all the way out in the open so other than that just as a uh, real man uh, working girls are a real man's best friend because that is what the value is work providing a service and for any of you out there that want to go ahead and get involved we have that available for you I think in Facebook and social media there's that backlash because it wasn't necessarily created for that but it's being used for that and need a support system to actually make that work for you so it, in this regards on this end uh, personal statement for me to you as a person that has quite a lengthy experience in regards to dealing with women on various levels from various different positions backgrounds occupations you name it um, one thing that all of you have in common is your need to be valued and respected your self-esteem so crystal just like the rest of the probably hundred or two million young ladies on Facebook are uh, putting their pictures up there to see what they're hitting for on the market that's just what we see emerging and in this particular case excuse me in this particular case uh, when it comes to crystal if you were one of those individuals that came looking for some some stripper footage uh, you can go ahead and find her locate her on Facebook she's got plenty of those images along with other images of her life as a complete person uh, you can request her she can make a decision as to whether or not to accept your friend request or maybe she can start one of those um, what do you call it Facebook fan pages or like pages I mean there's a variety of different ways that it can be done but basically at the end of the day she's just a regular female that does regular female things and needs the support of uh, somebody in the world to make it so that she can do her job more effectively and show the whole part not just this little piece but once again this is pimpop.com we kick authentic conversation and communication and if she's in real life in the flesh dealing face to face well this is the place because I'm talking to you as such and leave it up to me I'll be living proof but once again this is not my show uh, Crystal is the feature she's a starring artist and I'm just a narrator so other than that we're gonna say stay tuned in and tell a friend that's what we have to offer for you and we look forward to seeing more from you alright peace